Welcome back to the PSN Commanders Network. It's your boy Tonk A Tech. We're back with a video. If I get to a glory to God, for God's right now, God's up and doors, pay way for all you wonderful people. And Lord, let me pray. Amen. Today we're here right about, right about the Washington Commanders. And today we're here to talk about Dan Quinn's hires on the staff so far. Uh, we know we hired Cliff Kingsbury, the offensive coordinator. Um, and we also hired uh Joe Wade Jr. is our defensive coordinator. Now we have some new hires. Uh, oh, yeah. I hope God's open doors for all you want people in Bulls and you pray, man. I hope I said that. No, sir. Shout out to C.A. Stroud, man. Always getting the little, getting the little credit. All praise and glory goes to my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, man. Shout out to my boy C.J. Stroud. But let's get right to today's video. Like I said, we hired two coordinators already with Cliff Kingsbury and Joe Wade Jr. Now we have hired some offensive and defensive assistants. Um, we have now hired Jason Simmons, uh, now former Raiders uh, defensive pass game coordinator, as the same position, lateral position here in Washington as our defensive pass game coordinator. And also we have hired former offensive coordinator of the Philadelphia Eagles, Brian Johnson, to also be our offensive pass game coordinator. Let's talk about it. So let's start with the offensive side because I'm more familiar with Ben Johnson, uh, my ben, Brian Johnson. See. So we we're supposed to get a B Johnson. We got the wrong one. We got got Brian instead of Ben. So so about Brian Johnson here, uh, former offensive coordinator of the Philadelphia Eagles, was not the best play caller. Um, remind me of a lot of a thirty six year old E B. Shout out to whoever said that. I think Rio said that on on, on uh, Rio Robinson said on his channel. Um, he called him a thirty six year old E B. Uh, it's thirty six year old uh version of Eric Bieniemy. Completely agree. Dude don't know what the run game is. Um, he can't call a run game to save his life. But he did scheme up a nice pass game for Jalen Hurts. And he actually developed said Jaden Hur Jalen Hurts. So he knows how to develop young quarterbacks, um, which is a good thing. But he can't call plays to save his life. That's why he's not an OC in Philadelphia anymore. That's why he's had to take a downgrade to come to Washington and be a pass game coordinator. But he will help develop whoever the quarterback is. I believe it still could be Sam Howe, but more than likely it's not. It's probably more likely a Jaden Daniels or a Drake May or Caleb Williams, anyone? Caleb Williams, anyone? Uh, with Cliff being here, I know the speculation started with Cliff getting here, but I still don't think we're getting Caleb Williams. I still believe kid to D.C. is a dead dream. Um, I think it's dead upon arrival, DOA, dead upon arrival. Uh, but a dead on arrival, but, 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 but there is still an opportunity and still a chance. You say you have a chance to go get one Caleb Williams, but whoever the quarterback is, it doesn't freaking matter, right? I'm going on a freaking tangent here, but I don't care who the freaking quarterback is. Brian Johnson will help develop said quarterback. Are they going to keep the to feed a Pritchard here? I think the combination of those two minds will help out set quarterback. I like to be a preacher. He did help develop Sam Howe. Those first 10, 11 games from Sam were incredible for the most part. So I do believe that he can develop a quarterback as well. So I think it will keep him around. But we'll see. But I do like the Brian Johnson hire a lot. I will give it an A. Magnifico. Excellent. Magnifioso. Not perfecto, but it's pretty daggone good. Shout out to Dan Quinn, man. Now, Jason Simmons, the defensive pass game quarter, formerly of the Las Vegas Raiders. Now, I'm not as familiar with this young man as others are, but I did see those Raiders DBs. They don't look half bad. <laughs> I'll tell you that. They don't look half bad. Trey Armorick looks solid. Um, who's that? Who's that corner? Caught that pick six. Jack Jones, the one they picked up from the Patriots, he looks solid in a Raiders uniform late in that season, having a pick six against the Chargers. Did some other good things. Uh, some of the other guys on the roster, they don't look half bad. Uh, so, hey, hey, the college of them two might help in Emmanuel Forbes. Might continue to help develop Quan Martin, Derek Forrest, Cameron Curl if he's here, um, which I don't know. We'll see. But I think you always want that smart defensive player on your team that has an IQ. 
Speed does matter on defense, but you always want to have that IQ guy. And I think Cameron Crow brings you that IQ guy. What you looking at, TJ? Hmm? Hey, hi, TJ. Hi, y'all. Hi, y'all. So, Dad, I had the best dad. So, I know. So, I have a good dad, though. He's pretty cool. I love you, TJ. Mwah. Back to the point. So, uh, yeah, man. I love the fact that we do have two guys who are familiar with the other guys around. Brian Johnson is a very, very, very good uh, quarterback whisperer and quarterback developer. And also Jason Simmons is really good at developing secondaries. So I like these hires a lot. I find it really solid. Like I said, I'm not familiar with Jason Simmons as much as I am with Brian Johnson. I can only see the Raiders film and say, oh, these corners are not looking half bad. So that's all I can say about Jason Simmons. He does know how to develop talent, and he he will be able to assist the second. Now, I don't know who the DB's coach is going to be. I was hoping Al Harris. Unfortunately, the Cowboys said, hell no. They said, you're not touching my – you're not touching no of my coaching staff, all right? You're trying to say my tight ends coach. That's my DB's coach. Bro, can y'all leave my staff alone, bro? You can't go to the ops. We can't let them go to the ops no more. We already let our defensive coordinator go to the ops. Now, it, it took our – potential new defensive coordinator, and he, and he took him with the ops. We can't let the ops win, man. They, they up too much. They, they up the score that we got to – no, you can't do no more. No more, no mods, no mods. So he blocked the interviews of uh, Al Harris and also the Titans coach. Can't favor it. Can't favor the guy's name. Talking about but nonetheless, um, as Louis T say, I digress. <laughs> That's going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy it. I love the Brian Johnson hire. I think it's a heck of a hire. I'm like, well, he came from Philadelphia. Why well, hire him? We got dudes from Dallas. Let the, let the NFC East Avengers assemble and destroy the NFC East. I don't want no Giants coaches, though, if they name Brian Dayball. So I'll pass on that. I ain't, I ain't mind Wink. But Wink ain't, Wink ain't a Giant no more. He don't count. So. I don't want none of any position coaches. I don't want none of that crap. So I'm good on that, Slim. But Brian Johnson, Jason Simmons, welcome to D.C., Slim. Go get your chicken wing, my boss, off with the soda on the site. The side. That's going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy it. Like, comment, subscribe to the PSN Commands Network. Also, become a channel member, man. Become a channel member. You get exclusive, exclusive access to all the content on the channel. And also, you get members only live streams once per month starting in March. I don't care if I got two members, three members, four members. I will start members only live streams starting in March. Um, maybe the first. So it'll just be a chop up session. We just chop it up, talk. We might talk about life. You know what I'm saying? Um, kind of kind of spice up a little bit on the channel here. I'll subscribe my second channel, Life of Tone. Uh, unfortunately, the Life of Tone channel is not currently monetized. We too deny my monetization. I'm very pissed off at the moment. About that one, but you know, it's all good though. It's all good, but we'll subscribe anyway. Uh, loyalty test reactions, clothing hauls, and also story time videos. If you want that type of content, go subscribe over to Life of Tone, it'll be under the feature channel section. It'd be quite a lot. A L O T. Uh, so go subscribe to that as well if you haven't done so for more funnier. You see Tone over there, you see Pro Tech over here. So, if you want to see Tone, go subscribe over there. Um, me and TJ gonna say goodbye for now. And also, one more thing, go follow me, WHH on the daily on Instagram, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace, love, best of all y'all. Our DT Football Podcast tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We will be on the DT Football Podcast YouTube channel talking about the Super Bowl and giving predictions for said Super Bowl. So next time, man, y'all be easy, man. Peace.